Okay, I guess it's been going for maybe 25, 30 minutes now. Uh, I can see my multimeter there towards the bottom of the screen where it says it's about 82 degrees. That's how warm it is um, underneath the perforated board. Uh, first, I have one of those insulating heat reflector pads, and below that, I have a uh, small section of perf board like you use to hang your two tools on in the garage. And then the perf board is screwed to a number of short stubs of uh, two by fours to help support the perf board and provide an air gap underneath the perf board. And so that's how warm it is <clears throat> underneath the heat reflector pad and underneath the perforated board. Um, below the perforated board and two by fours, I put some cinder blocks, some square uh, 12 by 12 um, stepping stones, concrete blocks, and uh, uh, just to in case it got even too warm below the uh, heat reflector pad. So 82 degrees underneath there, and I don't think that would scorch the grass. In other words, I don't think I need to have the concrete stepping stones underneath there. So it's pretty, pretty good. You can see the uh, secondary burn process going on there. And so the way that works, the uh, air is drawn up from the bottom. It's a two-walled two wall stainless steel wall fire pit. So the outer wall, between the outer wall and inner wall, uh, cool air is drawn up the sides and comes around, uh, exits the, uh, the holes around the top there. That's where the secondary burn takes place. So down below here, it's about 200 degrees. And then up top, it's, uh, well, at one point is over 300. Yeah, 300 degrees. So that's how warm it gets as it enters the bottom. And as it comes up to the top, the secondary burn actually uh, burns the smoke as it exits the fire pit. So there's less smoke coming out the fire pit than without that secondary burn. And uh, in case you're wondering how much radiant heat you get off that, let's say you're standing, setting where that Brio box is at, how warm is that box? That's 103 degrees. And that's been sitting there, uh, I don't know, five or ten minutes. So that uh, pretty much provides evidence that you do get some radiant heat setting around the fire. And if you're that close, for example. Let's look on the inside one more time. <clears throat> 